Look at the little guinea pig. <laughs> All right, it's Shelter Sunday here. On the, I'm just going to lose it. We have Angela Maxwell here from the Bunny Hutch in Virginia Beach, and she brought Pocky the guinea pig. You guys have to see just how calm he is. He just sits still. Yeah. Tell us a little bit about Pocky. So Pocky is a show pig. <laughs> they can we show... turn him to the camera? <laughs> You're right. Pocky. So you guys can see his face. There, he there we go, bud. <laughs> so they're trained. So his fur pattern is kind of like a series of cowlicks, and we train all the animals at the shelter to, so that they're calm and they're used to interactions, which is why okay. we do stuff like this, the events at Turvis, to be able to get them used to kids touching them, holding them, picking them up. So most of the animals that we have are pretty chill. Okay, and Pocky is chill, but what type <laughs> of family or home would be ideal? So for it's really, he's really a great pet for any kind of a home. Okay. That um, younger kids, older kids, he's a pretty chill. Boxster. <laughs> no, I'm not going to touch your bum. <laughs> so just about any family. And our packages come with cage, food, toys, everything that he needs. Fact sheet about where he's from. A woman bought a whole bunch of them. Instead of looking online at pictures, right. she thought, I'll get a whole bunch of the different kinds of guinea pigs they show. And she was brushing them every day. Wow. So uh, Pocky was one of a very large purchase. Some of them require curlers. Their hair is so long. And what is it like to take care of a guinea pig? Do they require a lot of attention and maintenance? Or? So they like the attention. Okay. He's trying to turn around to look at you instead <laughs> of the camera. Um, that uh, they're really low maintenance. The cage just has to be spot clean, then super clean like once a week. Um, they get a small amount of grain, a lot of grass. His number one diet is Timothy Hay. Pocky. Okay, so if people are interested in taking Pocky home, what should they do? All they have to do is go online to the bunnyhutch.org and our application's online. So it's first come, first serve in, regard, in the order of the applications that we take in. And Pocky hasn't had anyone interested in him yet, but he just got out of isolation. Okay. We do everything, the mammal's 30-day isolation. He's fully vetted, microchipped, everything. <laughs> so Pocky's back in regular population with people, yeah. so <laughs> now he's ready to go home. All right, thank you so thank much, you. Angela. And remember, if you'd like to reach out to, or take Pocky home, reach out to yeah, the Bunny Hutch in Virginia Beach. We'll have more news and weather coming.